That's a tractor trailer full of wood chips. Up and up and up it rises until it's emptied for drying. Every wood scrap then to be turned into electricity. The wood-burning biomass electricity plant at Seneca Sawmill Company, north of Eugene, is one contributor to the local energy grid. Though more expensive than natural gas, for about a decade the Seneca plant has turned leftovers from the lumber-making process into steam, and steam into power for homes. After the wood chips are weighed and dried, they are sorted into Seneca's fuel building. Green and dried wood pieces are being constantly added to piles there. A mix of green and dry wood is used to keep furnaces burning at the right temperature. Too much green and the boiler wouldn't be hot enough. Too much dry and the flame would burn hot, but not for long. Water is applied and transformed into steam, which shoots through 15 Seneca turbines to move pinwheels. After the steam passes through five pinwheels, some is piped away into lumber drying kilns. The rest goes on to generate electricity. The water is sent to cooling towers and trickles down in a constant rain which allows the heat to dissipate from the water so it can be reclaimed and used again.